Hey guys, just got done putting together this multi-function home and gym that I just got. I put together a couple other ones and this one was by far the easiest. The instructions were amazing, everything was organized really nicely in step procedure, so it made it really easy. There is a ton of workouts you can do on this machine, cable driven, but it's also got a lot of bars as well. So let's walk through it a little bit and I'll show you some of the parts that come with it. So it does come with your landline attachment down here at the bottom. Um, you can do a small weight bar or a larger weight bar, and it does have little bolts to tighten onto the bars. And then you've got a landmark, landmine handle, and I'll show you how to use this in just a little bit. So you'll notice there's adjustable holes all the way up and down on both sides. That's gonna allow you to adjust not only the pulleys up front, but you've also, it comes with dip bar handles here. So from a height standpoint, whether you're taller or shorter, you can move those up and down and get some quality dips. So taking these off and on is as easy as twist it this way, pull it straight out, and then just reverse going back on. So another workout you can do is with these cables going up and down, it does come with row feet down here. So we'll show you in a minute, you slide all the way down here and you can do your rows. You do have front uh, blocks on both sides here. Um, I've got them low right now, but if I'm going to do back squats, I can easily stand outside of this and use this as my stop. And then down here behind your row feet, you've got your battle rope attachment. And then up above, you've got your pull-up bar, and it does have nice foam grips here on both sides. It makes it nice and comfortable for your pull-ups. Coming around to the sides, you've got attachment hooks up here. So your pull-down bar, um, your, your rope here, down. It also comes with, so if you've got a bench and you're going to do benches here, you've got a nice system on both sides, adjustable up and down. These little stubs here on the side is for hanging your weights when you're not using them. And then coming around to the back, here's your pulley system. So when you're doing any of the cable workouts, you're going to put your, your, bar, or your weights on these two sides here. I like to keep them balanced, it just keeps everything moving a lot more fluid and smooth. And then on the other side, You've got two more weight storages here, weight storage here, more storage hooks up here. Here's your ankle strap, which we'll go over that here in a minute. You got a close grip pull down bar and then more hooks for storage. Whether you have a large bar like I have here, it comes with lots of weight clamps. It also comes with a handful of small bar clamps as well if you have small ones. It does come with some extra chains and extra hooks. I've got the other grips on here now on both sides, which it also comes with. So, so far from what I've done on this thing, it is super sturdy, very durable, high quality powder coated steel. So let's jump into some workouts here now and I'll show you just a few of my favorites. One of my favorite workouts to do is just a normal back squat. You can do it outside, but if I've got the, the cable set up, I don't want to have to move everything. So I just use the small supports inside to hold my bar. And then I'll lower these to whatever height I need from a standpoint, just in case you get plenty of room to go all the way up and down inside the cage. A couple of my other workouts, I like to do flies, but I like to do three different heights. So this is as easy as loosening this, pull it out, slide it up, whatever height you want. I'm tall, so I usually go all the way up. Do the same thing on the other side. So with the versatility of this machine, you can easily do high flies. So you can focus more on your upper shoulder. And when you're adjusting them, obviously you want each side to be the same. So you can follow these numbers. So when you put one side on, you can make sure the other side is on the same level. And now the medium height, you're gonna focus more on your chest and even your traps a little bit. And then of course on the lowest setting, you're gonna be working more of the biceps. And with this one, you can do straight hand, or if you turn, you're gonna work different parts of the bicep. Once I'm done doing my flies, I wanna do some um, tricep pull downs. All you gotta do is unhook one attachment and put on your other one. And what's probably my favorite workout of all is just tricep pull downs. And this makes it really nice because it's very fluid. It makes it really easy to focus on my movements rather than jumpy, bouncy cables.
And with your large bar, you can do your lateral pull downs. And the good thing about this bar is you can do close grip, or if you want to widen out to focus on the outer lats, you can do that. All right, with the landmine handle, makes it really nice. I just slide it on the bar first and put your weights on it. Get a nice straight back grip. Another great thing about this Fearden system is to get your bar out of the way, it does have a bar shoulder right in there. When you're done, slide it in. And some things you might want to get, they sell um, accessories, just about anything you'd need. They sell benches, they sell um, weights themselves, any attachment you can think of, they're going to have it. So been really happy with this so far. I'm going to get a few more things from them to finish my, uh, my gym out. So far, I'm loving this gym. Very versatile, and it's a pretty small footprint as well. So if you're looking for a good multi-purpose machine um, to use through the summer, especially when the kids are out and they need to stay active, highly recommend this one from Peerdom. And like I said, they've got a lot of different accessories you can get with it. So thanks for watching, and I hope you found this helpful.